Hello and welcome to another Absorbing Golf Drill by me, Mark Jones. And today what we're going to do is, uh, I like reading, so we're going to use a book in order to uh, just give you a feeling or sensation of the movement of the golf swing. And uh, basically follow just three paths and then you can decide uh, which one works for you or um, which one can help you in your golf game. So, so first of all, just to imagine that uh, if you're standing in this position, that there's a table on my right side here, just a flat table that's just below my hips. There's a table there, and on the top of that is a shelf, okay, where I could put this book inside the shelf. And then on this side, there's another table, and I could put the book on, and then obviously uh, just a shelf on this side as well. So what I'm going to do is, wherever your golf ball is in front of you, open up your hands, you're going to take a book. This book is about 30 centimeters uh, long by about 20 centimeters. All right, doesn't really matter the, the size of a book, about this size, a hardcover or a magazine, whichever one you want. You're just going to hold your hands, hold a book, and just point the book down at an angle like this. So if you see from that angle, just down there like that. <coughs> Okay, so first, first, first show you a frontal angle and then a side angle. Frontal angle, okay, get the book like that. And what we're going to do is place the book on the outside on the table like that. And then we're going to put the book in the shelf like that. Okay, and then you're going to put the book back to on the table, back to position on the table on the left side. And then we're going to put the book back in the shelf on the shelf like that. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is just show you the different angles from a different view. <coughs> so, remember, table, shelf, table, shelf. Okay, looks like that. Put the book on the table in that position, and then put the book in the shelf in that position there. Get the book back on the table, back to your position, on the table like that, flat on the table, and onto inside the bookshelf. All right, so that's how that looks. Next thing we do, different path. So, same angle where you start with the, the book. You're gonna put the book on the table behind you, like this, and then put the book in the shelf, like that. Back to the table, back on there, on the table behind you, and back on the shelf, like that. All right, from this angle, show you, back in position, we're gonna put the back book on the table like that and the book in the shelf like that back on the table back in position back on the table and up in the shelf all right so that's pretty much the extremes all right so now we just do one that's in the middle or in the center <coughs> same startup position book on the table flat like that and then book on the shelf like that, back on the table, back in position, back on the table, and in the shelf. Okay, from this angle, <coughs> get the book flat like that, we get the book flat in this position, on the table, and we get the book on the shelf, or in the shelf, like that, back in the table, back in center, on the table like that, and in the shelf, like that. All right. Once you've done that with a book, and then you can just basically do that, get your golf club, and just work on the same three positions. You basically get into position, get the book in that position first, and then get the book in the shelf like that, get the book in position, down, in position there, and up into the shelf. The second position, club there, the club there, in the bookshelf like that, behind you, there. In the middle position, just get from there, the club straight up, position there, back, position there. Alright, and then you can work on those positions. Let me show you from a frontal view the three differences from there. First of all, the first one from there, you put it up inside the shelf, like that, down there, up on the shelf, up on the shelf, like that. The second 
position behind me there on the shelf like that behind back to square um, up on the shelf in the center position there up in the shelf down there back in the shelf all right so pretty much do you just do that with a book uh, take the book and you continue those three positions try and get one that suits you that fits with your swing fits with where you are at, your, at the swing at the moment and hopefully that can help you uh, with your swing that's basically how we use a book that can help us to feel uh, or get into the sensational feeling of the golf swing so uh, thanks for joining me uh, for another absorbing golf drill and we'll see you next time from me mark jones uh, goodbye